Maybe right in here, there's a little, little foothill lives right here. Just a little footy hill, right at the base of the mountain. Just tapped in the basic shape. Just a little footy hill. Bob Ross, the sound of his voice, the sound of his brush on the canvas, it was all so delightful. This morning we're seeing if we can make works of art with certified Bob Ross instructor, Ted Simpson. He teaches oil painting from his home and at the Monroe Hobby Lobby. Ted, thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. What makes you a certified Bob Ross instructor? Well, uh, Bob established a school uh, down in Florida and anyone can go down there and take a three-week course, very intensive painting course. Okay. And and at the end of the course, you are a certified instructor. And do you find that a lot of people want to learn how to paint like Bob Ross? Oh yeah, everyone seems to know Bob Ross. They've watched his uh, episodes uh, on PBS yes. back in the 80s. Uh, now they can watch them on Netflix and uh, YouTube and such. Everyone wants to give it a try. Okay, so uh, Ted's link, by the way, is Nature's Brush Studio. It's on Fox 2. We put a link to you on our website. Ladies, are you ready? Okay, we're, we're ready, ready to paint. Studio. Okay, right. so um, Ted, you're gonna go here and I'm gonna go over here here Perfect. and tell us uh, what are we first of all what are we creating here today we're just gonna create a little bit of a sunset style painting okay. uh, I figured with uh, the holiday right around the corner we'd try some red some white and some blue sounds good. good so the easiest thing that we do is we just hold our brush kind of like a pencil got it and you have a, a few colors on your palette there so go ahead and just tap just a couple little taps into the red. Tap, tap. tap That's tap, it. Tap. It doesn't take a lot. Okay. And then right up in roughly the center, you just make these crisscross strokes. And then you slowly work around and it just blends with the white that I already put on the canvas and oh. starts to make a lovely pinkish glow. Oh. Okay. And then you can also come down and and uh, put in a little bit down here that'll be in the water. I think I heard a brush drop, yeah. but uh, there we go. And the, the more that you work the paint into the liquid white, the lighter and softer it becomes. And then there, right off the bat, you have the start of a lovely sunset. Okay. Sure do. So why don't we just go ahead and pick up a different brush. Okay. And with the same motion, holding it roughly like a pencil. Got it. Right next to the red is a blue color. Okay. And we just tap into that a few times. Mm -hmm. tap, tap, tap. And now starting from the top, we're just going to put some X crisscross strokes all the way across the top, all the way across the top. And then we slowly work our way down to that pink. And it's going to hit that pink and it may turn a little bit lavender. We don't know, and it's all right if it does. We don't care, right? We don't care. We, we, we let it happen. It's art. We, that's right. Whatever happens on the canvas is that's just fine. Just happy mistakes, that's as right. Bob would say. That's right. Happy little accidents. Oh, happy accidents. Happy little accidents. I can see how go. this could be very calming I and know. Really relaxing. Absolutely. Hmm. There you go. You got a great start. Now we're just going to tap a little bit back into the blue once you've met with the uh, sunset pink. We tap a little bit more blue color, the same blue color. I'm having trouble figuring out what it's gonna look like at the end. <laughs> I know. Go ahead, go ahead. I know, absolutely. We're just going to come from the bottom and okay. work our way up with a little bit extra blue. Oh. Wait, are we using this other, the third color? Nope, or no, the we're same, still in the second color. Yep, the same blue. All right. And from the outside in, we just oh. come right to about the center. Oops. Uh-oh. Well, you didn't say that till the what end. Mean the That's okay if you if you don't do that that way. We can always make it work. We can always put a happy little tree in front of it. That's oh, right. Okay. There you go. That's, That's right. See. And then from both sides, we work in, and all of a sudden, just in two minutes now, we've got a sunset, do a we? sky, <laughs> and just with a couple of cross strokes all the way what across, we have like? our water. Okay. Okay. And go ahead and just bring it all the way together from huh. left to right, right to left, and then okay. we have, there you go. So that little line is like the sun or the moon. Oh, I just see. That's exactly it. The water. Exactly. The last mm -hmm. little bit of sunlight that is bringing it across. Mm -hmm. And now once, once we get that, with the time that we have left, we can just dip that same old dirty brush into the darker blue and we'll put in one of those footy hills we saw Bob doing. Um, Ted, we're gonna yes. take a break. Oh.
Ladies, don't put your brushes down. How's it going? I don't know. I missed oh, that, I miss that's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of a square sunset. Yeah. Um, oh. Okay. So or, that looks good. That looks like a heart. What? Oh, it's kind of a kidney bean. It's, <laughs> it's a sunset. Okay. Um, been quite a day. Ladies, how are you yes. feeling about your painting? Um, feeling good. Yeah, since I'm I did go back to it. Totally on my own. Okay, Ted Simpson teaches Bob Ross style paintings. He's certified in everything. Thank you for coming in, Ted. Thank you. By the way, uh, if you want to have a little Bob Ross party, which I think would be fun would at be your fun. house, yeah. mm -hmm. um, Ted will come to your house. And bring all the supplies, right? That's right. That's right. Drop cloths. You won't get all messy. Just wear an apron or so, and you'll be all set. <laughs> yeah, and you can pick kind of what you want to paint. Absolutely. All right. Let's. Can I show you? Mine? You want to? You want to start with Marielle over oh. here? Ted, come over here. All right. Here. Uh, okay. Stay. Just turn this way towards towards the camera. What do you think go? about my technique? Oh. I think you did a great job. Thank now, you. what we have here, you can clearly what see that there's here? a sunset. <laughs> <laughs> and she put in the sky, and we all already put in uh, a bit of the uh, clouds. Yeah. And we even have the start of the reflection in the water. And all okay. we need to do to finish this particular painting off is put in a couple of happy trees. Listen, I feel like <laughs> this is our zip line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it that's felt what like it that. is. That was, that's she what was, was still on thinking about this. Uh -huh. So let's go to Jessica's painting now, Ted. All right. It's more abstract. I, uh, hers is I feel more, like I need more clouds. Oh. It's kind of squarish. What do you see well, there? I see, I see a good, again, a great sky, and she has the technique down to throw yeah. in the, the fluffy clouds. There you go. And the only thing that we need to do is put in a little bit of a water line so we can separate the footy hill from the water. Okay. Okay, and how do we do that? <laughs> yeah, that's that, like any direction. Class. Okay. That, that takes about more. five seconds. Oh, just like right. you. Okay. Yours looks great. You have two foothills happening here. I really do. And we just need to <laughs> just put in a little bit of a white line, and that'll show the difference between the land and the water. There we go. We can do that. Yeah, okay. Um, so this is fun. There's something very peaceful. The, about it was putting the brush on canvas, don't you, ladies? Think yes. Oh, that's right. Wait, are we gonna, unless you're very competitive, then oh. you know it might bring out the the, the monster in you. Well, yeah. it's, it it's great. It's it's every day is a good day when you paint. So right. take take away your cares and troubles. I mean, it's not a competition, Ted, but and there's no losers. But if you were picking the winner, who would you pick? Oh my gosh! And if you had <laughs> to I pick the winner, <laughs> I think you should pick from like who did you help the least? I oh. the well, gosh, I've I've are been married. Like I've been yeah, married long quick. enough to yeah. know not to answer the last <laughs> oh, two questions. Oh, okay. He's so. smart. All right. Good answer, Ted. Ted, thank you so much. Thank you. And we put a link to Ted's website if you want to uh, get in touch with him, take yeah. one of his classes, do a private party with him. He'll do it. That'd be fun. A little Bob Ross uh, relaxation. Thanks, well, Ted. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right, so, Jess. Let's time to talk weather.